Hey guys, welcome to the Mobile Central. Today we are looking at two very interesting smartphones, Asus's ROG 5, which is the latest gaming smartphone from Asus, and the OnePlus 9 Pro, the flagship killer's latest flagship device. So both of these phones have exactly same internals, Snapdragon 888 and 12 GB of RAM. So I thought it would be a good idea to put them next to each other and understand how do they perform in terms of their speed tests. So we're going to look at a lot of interesting things today and understand how good are these phones because both of them are actually very close to each other in terms of their pricing. So let's get started. Okay, so let's get started with our speed test. We're going to look at multiple varieties of apps from games to casual apps, etc. And before we get onto that test, I need to highlight a couple of things to you. Both of these phones are connected to the exact same Wi-Fi. And you can see that beside this, there is no other app open in the background. Okay, so let's start with a speed test. We'll go with the internet speed test first and then we look at multiple other things. And while this test is continuing, I need to highlight something to you that I have pulled the refresh rate on ROG 5 to 120 Hz, not to maximum of 144 Hz because OnePlus 9 Pro cannot go beyond 120 Hz. So I wanted to eliminate any sort of bias in this test and therefore I have done this. So, okay, so internet speed test, we are uh, almost done with the ASUS's ROG 5. Once we are done with this, we will start with OnePlus 9 Pro. Both of them, like I said, are connected to the same Wi-Fi signal. So they should have very similar results in terms of their speed tests in where the internet speed is considered. So, okay, so we have the results from ROG 5, which is 71 and 20. Let's see how the OnePlus 9 Pro performs on this test. Okay, it's going sort of okay, but I would say it's drastically lower than ROG 5, which is quite a surprise to me. It's almost, it's crazily down. I mean, do you guys have any thoughts about this? Can you tell me in the comments, why do we have such huge variance in the internet speed between ROG 5 and the OnePlus 9 Pro? Do let me know in the comments below. It'll be an interesting thing to know. Okay, so upload speeds are very close to each other, but download speeds, you can see ROG 5 is way ahead of OnePlus 9 Pro. All right, so we're done with this test. Now we're gonna go and launch certain apps. We'll start with some casual apps, which we use on a day-to-day -day basis. Okay, Google Maps. I think OnePlus 9 Pro was split second ahead, but I wouldn't call that a winner based on this small difference. Google app. I think both of them very close to each other. Calculator. Now I'll just put something here so that we can come back to see how the background uh, apps management is happening on both of these phones when we come back to the second round of this, which is very interesting. Just wait for that because I have noticed some very crazy things there. Okay, camera. Okay, so ROG 5 has already launched the camera and you saw how much time OnePlus 9 Pro took to launch the camera. Okay, we'll go into the Chrome now. ROG 5 was way ahead of OnePlus 9 Pro. Amazon. See, OnePlus 9 Pro is still loading the app. I think it's because of the slow internet speeds, I guess. Noon, which is an e-commerce app for UAE users. Let's see which one loads the first. Okay, I think ROG5 was hair split second ahead, but again, not a winner based on this app. Wouldn't call it. eBay. I think OnePlus 9 Pro had an upper hand here. We'll go into Mintra app. All people from India would definitely know about this app. Okay, OnePlus 9 Pro did a good job there. Now let's go to Bezel. It's the eBay for UAE users. Okay, I think OnePlus 9 Pro launched the app later, but loaded everything much faster than ROG 5. Let's go into social media apps now. Twitter. OnePlus 9 Pro, very split second ahead again. Instagram. I think it was ROG 5. Yes, ROG 5. Reddit. Let's, oh, okay, OnePlus 9 Pro is ahead. Social media, I think, is, is very good with OnePlus 9 Pro. YouTube. OnePlus 9 Pro again. It's catching up pretty good. Netflix. I think it was ROG 5. Yes, ROG 5 was good here. Now we'll get into the games, which is the most interesting part. And ROG 5 should actually perform much better in this round. So let's look at the games. We'll start with some casual games, get towards the heavier games later on. Okay, we'll start with the Bazooka Boy. ROG 5 should perform better, let's see. Yes, ROG 5 was slightly ahead in terms of launching this Crowd City. Okay, I'm gonna just start playing this game so that we understand what happens in terms of when we come back 
to memory management so you remember this game has started okay sky force this is the game that i play a lot okay rog5 rog5 definitely was ahead we'll go into asphalt this is a slightly resource intensive game rog5 already off the charts let's see okay rog5 is i think i if i should not be surprised if rog5 does this round better because it's a dedicated gaming phone after all okay let's give it a minute let's see which one performs better okay of course rg5 one plus nine pro is way behind still loading the game all right so you saw there's a huge difference between these two phones okay one two three yeah i think the loading time was slightly slower on one plus nine pro after tapping it registers a slight later i guess anyway let's look at how the progress goes now ah, okay rog5 is slightly ahead of course this is what we expected out of these two phones right all right okay so we're done now we'll get into the round two of understanding how the memory management is we we'll launch all of these apps again quickly understand which of these apps were actually in the memory which of them were not okay we'll start with maps again see if it was loading again or okay it's loading again on both of these phones so both of these phones killed that app We'll get into Google app. I think that was in the memory for both of these phones. Calculator. Remember we left some calculations here. Okay. Calculator is in the memory for both of these apps. Camera. OnePlus 9 Pro again launching the app and taking forever. So yeah, that's the issue. Let's look at Chrome. Chrome again taking a lot of time on OnePlus 9 Pro. So memory management is not very impressive so far on OnePlus 9 Pro. Let's see how it performs further on this test. Amazon. See, Amazon was here, but it's launched again on OnePlus 9 Pro. So OnePlus 9 Pro is not doing a good job in terms of memory management. Okay, let's continue. Again, this was in memory on Rogue 5, not on OnePlus 9 Pro. This is not a good sign for OnePlus 9 Pro. eBay. Again, both of these phones had killed eBay. Mintra. Both of these phones did not keep this app in the memory. Okay, so this one was in the memory for ROG 5, not in the memory for OnePlus 9 Pro. So OnePlus 9 Pro is not doing a good job in terms of memory management. Let's look at Twitter. Okay, I think it, it was not in the memory on OnePlus 9 Pro, but you guys saw this video. Just have a look and tell me in the comments what do you think about this. Instagram. Instagram was in the memory for ROG 5 because it's the same image that we saw when we launched the app for the first time and here it reloaded completely again. Okay, let's go on to Reddit. Reddit again relaunching on this phone, OnePlus 9 Pro, terrible job in terms of memory management. YouTube, I think it's pretty clear it's not doing a good job in terms of memory management. Netflix. Okay, Netflix was killed on both of these phones. Now let's look at games. We played a game and we left it casually to see if the memory management is good. Bazooka Boy, not in the memory for both of these phones. Both of the games were killed. Let's not wait for all of that. Okay, Crowd City was something that we played and we left in the memory. Okay, let's see how it goes. Here, see my game still running here and this is relaunching the game. So OnePlus 9 Pro, terrible, terrible job in terms of memory management. I should definitely not put my money on this phone then. Skyforce, in memory, again on ROG 5, not on OnePlus 9 Pro. Similar results that we have seen so far. So I think the story is going to continue here. Yes. This is in memory here, it's launching and this one's taking forever. Okay, I'm not gonna wait for it because it just doesn't make any sense. Last, Call of Duty. Okay, in memory here and in memory here as well. So this game was in memory for both of us. So, so I think it's pretty clear guys. You tell me in the comments, which of these phones do you think has won this test? According to me, ROG5 did a good job in memory management and app launch was pr pretty much close to each other in both of these phones. So yeah, that concludes my test. Hit a thumbs up if you liked the video and do let me know what you think about this video and subscribe if you want to watch more of my content. Thank you for watching guys. Cheers.